but it is not over. Out of the huddle they come. David Dias is flanked to the right, Coldine Walsh to the left. Split backs behind the quarterback, Tipton. Tipton with a long count. Now backs up. It's a four-man pattern. Throws over the middle for Dias. Great catch at the 20. And he is inside the 20 at the 18. He almost broke it for the score. What a catch by Dias. What a throw by Tipton. First down for the Rainbows inside the Wisconsin 20. You said it all. Two people. Tipton with a great throw, and Dias with an unbelievable catch. What effort. Gaskell and Colding Walsh are now the wide receivers. First and 10 from the 18. Back to pass, Tipton. He looks. He throws to the end zone. Throws it away. Incomplete. 55-0. Seconds left to play in the game. Now, we've said it before. This is where the yards get tough. Rainbows have to spring a receiver free in that end zone. They are not going to do it with running plays. They've got to throw it. Tipton has got to be pinpoint perfect if he expects to win this game with 50 seconds remaining. A dramatic finish here at Aloha Stadium. 45,000, over 45,000 looking on. Wisconsin fans in the end zone. They get up to make noise. Rainbows break the huddle. Coldine Walsh is to the right. David Dias is to the left. Double coverage on Dias. Second down. The ball just inside the 20. Back to passes. Tipton looks for the end zone. Throws for Dias. It is caught at the two-yard line. Now stop the clock. That was all David Dias. All David Dias. Nice pass as he picks up 17 yards. Excellent pass from Greg. But David beat the man on their coverage. He got himself open in the far corner. And the Bulls have got a great shot to win this game. The clock is running. 39, 38, 37. The ball is inside the two on the near hash mark. 33, 32, 31. Rainbows break the huddle. They come to the line. I formation, Kroll and Briggs. Tipton gives it to Briggs, leaps! Doesn't get it, doesn't get it. He's inside the one, 19 seconds left. Rainbows call a timeout. Rainbows call a timeout. They have the ball inside the Wisconsin one. The Rainbows, who have spent the night in frustration, who have spent the night trying and trying again, now have a chance to win it. 19 seconds left. This is storybook. This is what Division I college football is all about. You got it, Jim. I'll tell you, it's just a great effort. It's a great effort all the way around. We take a look at David Dyess on the replay, going high in the air, fully extended and fighting for that football. Jim, they've got 19 seconds. They've got one timeout remaining. The situation is, it, what is it, first down? Is it second down? Second down, I take that back. They've got plenty of time. Under control, lots of poise. They could take it right here. One timeout remaining after this. Rainbows have the ball inside the one yard line. 19 seconds left. They have, as you said, they have time to win it. What a comeback by the Rainbows. Greg, we, have said, we have said before that the Rainbows have spent the whole night trying and trying to get something going. And here at the end, they have a chance to beat Wisconsin, to defeat this team from the Big Ten. Out of the huddle come the Rainbows. You see the story right there. High formation behind Tipton. Second and goal to go. Tipton turns, gives it. No, has it. He's going to die for the end zone. Does he get in? Yes, touchdown. There are no flags. No flags. The touchdown is good. Tipton faked the play action to Briggs. Kept the ball, rolled around the right side. The receivers were not open. Tipton decided to take it in himself, go for the end zone, and broke the play. And Jim, I'm going to tell you, there's 13 seconds left on the clock. And when it was 13, 13, I said, this could be good luck. 13 seconds, we'll take a look at it on the replay. Great, great play action. Excellent job by the offensive line. They block everybody. And then Tipton, with great effort, just gets in there. Valverde to try the extra point. It is 19 to 17, Rainbows. 13 seconds left. The ball is placed down. It is kicked. It is good. 13 seconds left. The Rainbows come from behind. They lead Wisconsin 20 to 17. And the Wisconsin bench is shocked. What a comeback by the Rainbows. What a story for comeback. What a night. And Dick Tommy has his headphones off. 
He's across the way. Jubilation. Absolute jubilation on the rainbow bench. This is big time now. This is big time. The defense has just got to be tough. They've got to get the good kick off here, Jim. You can anticipate probably another squib kick. Rainbows go 80 yards in nine plays, tipped them from a yard out. Goes in for the score. 13 seconds left. That's all. That is all the time left from a victory for the Rainbows. Their first ever over a big 10 2. 20 to 17. Hawaii. What a comeback. What a game. Great overcoming adversity, Jim. They've got to wait and see if they can win this now. It's still. Don't like to say it's over till it's over, but I'll tell you, they've really overcome the adversity. Rutkowski comes forward and kicks it. A driving kick that lands on the 15-yard line, bounces to the 5. It is picked up there by Owens. He is to the 15-17. Down he goes. Patrick McCray on the tackle. Fred Owens just returned it over the 15 to the 17. Nine seconds left. The Rainbows will go into a prevent defense. 20 to 17 in favor of the Rainbows over Wisconsin. Nine seconds left, and how many people left this stadium with about nine minutes left, even five minutes left? Out of the huddle comes Wisconsin to the line. Tompkins is to the far side. Fester to the near side. High formation behind the quarterback, Howard. Howard takes the play action, back to pass. He's in trouble. Chase out of the pocket by Noga. Noga has him. Four seconds. Three, two. Two seconds left. Wisconsin calls the timeout. Oh, this is great stuff. This is great stuff. Dick Tomey trying to control his team right now. This place is rocking. There's only two seconds left. And I'll tell you, Wisconsin's got a lot to think about, and this Hawaii defense has just played magnificent tonight. Magnificent. Al Nonga chased down Howard. Two seconds left. This will be the final play, the final snap. And as we said, uh, with football, and we said about adversity, and we said about not giving up this is a perfect example of it you know you're absolutely right this at this part of the season if they can do it here and it looks like they're going to do it jim is everything that you could possibly ask for to give your team the kind of confidence that it needs to face the schedule that they're going to face this is perfect this is as you said storybook this is great from a broadcaster and a fan standpoint this is super and for the kids especially two seconds left Wisconsin burning their final timeout, or it could be their second timeout, but it doesn't make any difference now with two seconds remaining. Howard will probably wind it up and throw it deep. You gotta throw it for Odoms. Tipton, <laughs> Tipton tonight, 31 for 46, 372 yards, that's a record. It eclipses 337 yards against Kansas last year. He's intercepted three times, but he does the job when he has to do it. Two seconds left. Rainbows will only rush two. They come out in a prevent defense. Howard with split backs behind him. Back to pass. Looking. Looking. Throws. Incomplete. It's over. The Rainbows have upset Wisconsin. 20 to 17. What a win. What a victory. What a night. What a game. You can't say anymore, Jim. One of the best ones we've seen here in a long, long time. What an incredible effort. We'll say it again, they overcame great adversity. Two touchdowns called back, a ground game that sputtered, but nonetheless, they did what they had to do when they had to do it, and that's what this whole football game is all about. Balls came through when they had to. Congratulations to everybody in green down on that field. So the Rainbow fans have stuck with them in this game, who overcame all of the adversity. The Rainbows come back and they storybook their way to a victory. 20 to 17 over Wisconsin for their first victory ever over a Big Ten team.